Hey, GearHeads, Jeff with Gear Report here, the Project Humvee Battle Wagon, to give you the full review of the Smith & Wesson M&P Shield 45. Why am I doing that? I don't know. So if you're new to our channel, we do firearms reviews. We also have a Humvee that we do a lot of upgrades on. We do outdoor gear and activity reviews. So if you're into kayaking, if you like camping or backpacking, go ahead and subscribe now. We got a lot of content coming your way, a lot more reviews in the hopper. We appreciate that. Hit subscribe, hit the little bell button so you get the notifications when we post new content as well. Let's talk about, from Smith & Wesson, the M&P Shield M45. This was a huge splash right before the NRA show in 2016 when it was announced this was coming out. We were able to get one shortly after that and we're able to give it a pretty good workout. What do you need to know if you're looking to buy this? Uh, the M&P 45 Shield is a compact 45 ACP semi-automatic pistol. If you're looking for something to conceal carry and you like the 45 round, this is probably a pretty good option for you. What, when I say it's a concealed carry gun, what I mean is it is uh, rounded on the front, it's rounded on the back. There aren't a lot of sharp edges to print under your clothes when you're carrying it. That, that's one of the things that they do. As a concealed carry piece, it has a 6.1 round capacity with this magazine. It's flush with the bottom of the magwell. You can go up to a 7.1 round capacity in this one that extends a bit further. For me with my big hands, you know, I'm 6'4", you can see there's actually a little bit hanging out the bottom. So it gives me plenty of room to get a good grip on it. With the six round, even with my big hands, I can shoot it, it's controllable. It's not quite as comfortable for me as moving up to the seven plus one. If you're looking at this, it's because you want a concealed carry gun in 45, and I think it fits the bill very well. It's a 3.3 inch barrel. It weighs about 20 and a half ounces. So it's gonna be somewhat light-ish. You don't want it too light. This is still a 45. If it's too light, it's gonna kick a lot. All right, it's heavy enough. Now we're gonna to switch to the Defender Ammunition Company ammo. Let's see how this one does. Again, 230 grains. So let's see what kind of muzzle flip we get out of this one. What I really like about it, some changes that they introduced with the 45 Shield were a different grip texture that's kind of like sandpaper. And to be honest with you, if you walk into a gun store and pick it up, you may think, this is going to tear my hand up. It's a little too aggressive. I mean, that was my thought. Uh, but honestly, shooting it, it gave it a really good grip. And, and my palm did get pink the first time I shot it, you know, put a lot of rounds through it. But I adjusted to it pretty quickly. And it's not uncomfortable. It works pretty well. Another change that they made to the M&P line with this, with the introduction of the 45 are these forward serrations. You'll see both the grip and the forward serrations carried over to the M&P 2.0 line that was introduced at SHOT 2017. So this 45 Shield kind of led the way with some of those innovations and changes within the M&P line. Uh, it comes, this version, with two white dots in the back, one in front. See right here we have a safety. It's available with and without the safety. So if, if you prefer kind of the pro model mindset of I don't want a safety on my gun, you don't have to have it. Um, for this, I'll just leave it off because I, I kind of am of that mindset. Easy, your takedown lever and your slide hold back are here on the left side. You can see the mag release button is not ambidextrous out of the box, but you can take it out and flip it. So if you're a left-handed shooter, you put the, uh, the pad where you push over on the other side uh, so you can get to it that way. Overall, I've been very happy with this. For a 3.3 inch barreled 45 ACP, I'm able to put up pretty reasonable groups with this. And I think more than anything, it's just that it feels natural in my hand. They got the grip right. It's an 18 degree angle, which is pretty common on the, the shields and the, the M&P line. Uh, and it really just feels pretty good to me. It, it aligns pretty well. And although it's a 45, which has got a little bit of thump to it, it doesn't jump around and flip too much. Now I compare this to a Springfield 
XDS 45 in the 3.3, which is what this is replacing for me. Uh, the XDS, I get a lot more muzzle flip. It jumps around a lot more. I'm able to stay on target better. I don't know if it's the grip angle, the texture, the weight. I, I don't know what it is. What I know is that this feels better to me. Um, the XDS also, if you have big, big hands, it's, it's a little on the small side. And this, um, the M&P 45 shield gives me a little bit better feel, better purchase on the firearm with my hand. So that's, that's what I like about it. We put a lot of rounds through this. I had absolutely no issue shooting. You know, Defender Ammunition Company shot a bunch of their 230 grain plated rounds. We shot defensive rounds from Sig Sauer ammunition, from Gorilla ammunition, uh, from Federal. Put a lot of different types of ammo through here. Didn't have a single feed jam or eject issue. It's run like a top. It's reasonably accurate for what it is. Across the board, I'm pretty happy with it. Love to tell you more things I don't like, but really don't have any. So that's it. You can go check it out in the description. You'll find some links to where you can go get it. Brownells, I know, carries these. If you have any questions, put them in the description. Please don't forget to check us out on all the social media platforms. Give us a like, subscribe. If you're watching this on YouTube, it'd mean a lot to me if you go ahead and click the subscribe button and then the little bell beside it, that's for notifications. So when we post new videos, you'll know about those. You can see we got a lot of stuff coming that you don't want to miss. The Smith & Wesson M&P 45 Shield, and we'll see you at the range.